Good morning, Mr. Chan, Mr. Saunders, Ms. Becker, Ms. Girl Teddy, teachers, staff, parents, guardians, and finally my fellow JMS graduates. My name is Ruby Anke Migisha Tumsime, and I come from Kampala, Uganda. I am standing in front of you all because I was I have been chosen to be this year's vote of thanks by my class. I came to Columbia International College on January 7, 2016, where I started my journey in the junior middle school program. When I first arrived to CIC, I was a very quiet and shy person. My first day at school, I was afraid that I would I would not make any friends, and I was scared to participate in class discussions in front of new people. I honestly, I honestly thought I would not be able to make it here as it was so different back home. However, my experience at CIC has been an amazing adventure. It has been an adventure because I've, I have experienced new things like seeing snow for the first time, experiencing different seasons and getting to know people from different cultures. I also learned new things that I didn't know before, like I didn't know that Canada was a country and it existed. <laughs> I learned how to make s'mores at Bark Lake and how to canoe at Bark Lake. And finally, I learned how to make friends easily. My amazing adventure did not come easy, even if my siblings were here starting with me because I was still far away from my family. I still felt very homesick, and I especially miss my parents and younger siblings. It was very difficult because I was finding it hard to adapt to a new environment and the new weather conditions here in Canada. Now I would like to take the time to thank the people at CIC who made my adventure unique and unforgettable. First, I would like to thank Mr. Chan because if it was not for him, I would not be here at CIC. I would like to thank the JMS house friends and residence staff because they helped me through at times in my life especially when I was homesick and when I'll get sick. They will make sure I was taking medicine and getting enough rest to get better. I would also like to thank the JMS teachers who have taught me topics and lessons that I hadn't yet learned back in Uganda. They have also taught me new skills in life that I'll be able to use on a daily basis. I want to thank Ms. Girl Teti for the leadership of the JMS department and making the school a great place to learn. My parents also deserve a huge thanks because without them, I would, I would not have been able to get a better, a better education and be able to grow into the person I am today. Yeah.